And he's gone. He's gone. Poking at the delivery outside the off stump. VVS Lakshman not making a mistake. Nathan Assel's bad form continues. And India have struck back in the first over itself. It's just what Srinath and India wanted. And Vivius Latchman with the safe pair of hands. Astor, key player on the way back. Astor's gone for naught. And New Zealand, one for one. Really want to see their batsmen click over here. They're praying that their bowlers do the trick. Oh, that's a good one. He's out. That is a very, very good delivery. Macmillan's poor form continues. Holding its line, that delivery from Javagal Srinath. Macmillan neither forward nor back. Indecisive shot. Uncertain prod outside the off stump. And Rahul Dravid making no mistake. India are fighting back. New Zealand are 48 for four. Brendan McCullough would be looking. They've already seen him keep wickets. He did a good job and this is how Macmillan was out. Uh, Macmillan uh, is a very positive character. He thinks that he's got an answer to just about everything. But he didn't really have an answer to this one because uh, it was just an uncertain prod at uh, a delivery outside the off stump. The series can go completely different way. This was the Macmillan dismissal. First ball of a new spell from Srinath. What it's also showing you is that if you have three quality seamers, then the captain has so much more to play with. Why wasn't Srinath in playing test match? Field said he's not up to it. Field is better off. And he's out. Or oh, is he? Yes. yes. Yes, he is. Well, McCallum. Making the walk back to the pavilion. Playing inside the line. The ball not coming into the batsman. Holding its line. There it is. Just a little away movement. And I think he got a bit of glove on it rather than the bat. Rahul Dravid making no mistake and delightfully appealing for that catch. And look at the situation now. 52 for 5. Conditions uh, here ideal for seam bowlers. Ball bouncing a little bit more than uh, the wicket keeper expected. And uh, did it go off the sleeve or did it go off the glove? At this stage of the game. He's got him. They've all gone up. Mill stays there, but the finger goes up. And Srinath has answered his captain's call. He's taken a fourth. New Zealand have lost a seventh. It's still game on. Tremendous shot in the arm for the Indians. They needed a wicket. They bought back their premier fast bowler, Srinath, back into the harness. Here he is. Drawing the batsman on the front foot. Confusing him. Putting him in a quandary. And once again, the old war horse answers to his captain's troubles. He picks up Kyle Mills for 21. Semblance of a hope, a ray of hope once again ignited for the Indians. 86 for 7. Strange shot to play this. Sherry with a long time in front of him from the captain. Absolutely trying to play against the swing, work it on the onside. Looking to play it, play him over mid on because this ball swinging away from him. The extra he'll have a short one here. Big shout, the height is good. Srinath provides yet another breakthrough. And Craig McMillan while well, trying to pull this one, it was in no position at all to pull that one you might think that it was going down the uh, leg side but it was a very very poor shot for somebody who's out of form trying to play 
a cross batted shot. He's paid the price for it. He's walking back to the pavilion, 157 for three. Well, Providence pays off in the end. And Srinas, with a mixture of pace, guile, experience, removes Lou Vincent. Yes, he just seemed to have too much time to play this. It was a slower delivery. He waited, waited, and just played it onto his stumps. Right off the middle of the bat. He can't believe it, but he's played his part here. This is a useful hand from Lou Vincent. 34, New Zealand, 224 for six. He should be on the line. That's high in the air. Ganguly is coming underneath. It's very high. He takes it. Excellent catch. Srinath gets the wicket he wants. And I think there's a bit of a send-off for Astral here. Big wicket. And if he had been on the line, then it would have been pretty simple for him to catch. Instead, he was a little bit further up, going for the big hit. And look at that. He's got to move backwards. He's got to move backwards. And that's a bit tough to catch. The swirling catches. If he had been on the line, on the edge of the circle, there it is. On the edge of the circle, he would have had to move not a bit. Nathan Assel, very good hand. 32, 50. It's gone. Rahul Dravid takes the catch. Srinath has removed Nathan Astle, and New Zealand have lost their first. Good piece of bowling. Right length, right line. And Nathan Astle drawn into the shot. On this occasion, just playing a little bit away from the body. Just reaching out for it, and that has brought about his downfall. Dravid slip, safe in the slip cordon. So New Zealand lose their first wicket. Astle departs for 15, 28 for one. Top order batsman out early. Especially in these conditions where the ball is nipping around a bit. That is a good piece of bowling. The length good. Pitched up. He threw the batsman forward. And Dravid's taken some good catches on this trip. 18. Gone. Fleming gone this time. Just short of his 50. Sawag touches the catch. Return to form for Fleming. But he goes uh, with 101 on the board and just 22 to win. Some solace for the Indians. The lion-hearted Srinath into the act again, drawing him on the front foot, putting him in a quandary, extra bit of bounce, takes the edge, accepted gleefully by Sehwag. Stephen Fleming departs after a very well-made 47. 101 for two. It's a hopeless cause for the Indians. No doubt about that. Srinath continues and bold. Craig McMillan has been going through an absolutely terrible phase. And Srinath has picked up number three here. Well, he's in no form whatsoever, is he? And Srinath bang on target. Right length two when someone's feet isn't moving. He keeps the ball up. McMillan, if he looks at it, would be thinking he should have been playing forward instead of back. Again, stranded on the crease. And another failure. Departs without tickling the scorers. 103 for three. What a delivery from Srinath. Fleming and the dangerous cans has been broken. And very good captaincy. He could have gone to Kumblai, but he brought Srinath back because he knew that he still had a bit of tank petrol in the tank and he needed to remove Cairns and he's done it. Srinath has done it. Cairns has gone for 25 on comeback, 48 for four. He's cleaned him up. Up and straight. He's made so many incursions into Indian territory. Now this is the dismissal. Soft dismissal. Daryl Tuffy, no clue whatsoever. Not in line. No foot move. Bowling, played it on. We've seen a lot of uh, playing on in this series. Well, he's had a charmed life, but it had to come to an end. Going down the wicket twice positively in the over, but this time staying rooted to the crease. Bowled 
and went straight through him, just like he did in Wellington. Srinath on fire here, boy, this is a big blow. Cairns gone. Again, realising that Cairns is not moving his front foot towards the ball, but leaving a big gap, and you can see that. The incoming delivery, which is his stock delivery, once again working for Javagal Sina. This is a beauty of a delivery. It's a big blow. Now Srinath's gone up straight away and the batsman's gone out straight away. He has delivered. Just what the doctor ordered for. Just when Ganguly looked up at Srinath and said, Hey man, I need a wicket. There it is.